welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel Ray and today I have some diamond painting accessories to share with you on this Mail Hall Monday. <laughs> it's been a really long time since I have found some diamond painting storage solutions. I do have a video all about that if you're interested right up here in the eye and I'll have it linked in the description box below. But I saw this and I thought, you know, this would actually be a good comparable solution that's not too expensive and accessible on Amazon. Now, to be clear, this is Amazon UK and not Amazon USA because I don't live over there. I'm really sorry, but I can't have stuff shipped from Amazon US. I could theoretically, but do I want to be responsible for that much carbon tax? No. So I went to the next best thing, which for me ugh, is Amazon UK. When are they going to have an Amazon Ireland? I don't know. Oof. Oh my goodness. All right. So here it is. Ta-da. Check it out. So it's actually even listed as a diamond painting product. And like I said, I'm going to have this link down below because I saw it and I was like, ooh, this looks, this looks interesting. I think I could get into this. So let's see what it comes with. We have stickers. Very handy. Those you could put the diamond painting or the DMC numbers on rather. And then, don't break it. Okay, it's wrapped in bubble wrap. Good sign. Out. Let's see. Ooh, check this out. Okay. So, this little plastic piece came off. I'm going to put it over there because I don't know. It comes with a funnel. This is really good because if you are maybe taking your diamond paintings out of lots of plastic bags. Oh, there's ink on it or something. You can have this foldable, collapsible funnel to put it into the little bits. But let's let's actually get into the meat and potatoes here. We've got four drawers and they have Tic Tac containers inside. Now, I have heard from people in the group, Crafters Anonymous with Miss Crochet and Coffee and Rachel Ray. You can join it. There's a link down below. Uh, and here on my YouTube comment section that some people prefer the Tic Tacs over other container systems. But... I've had Tic Tacs in the past and I'm not so sure. Hopefully these will be a better quality than the ones that I had before. Let's let's check it out. There are four drawers. Okay, it's promising. They actually close, that's important. And you would just basically take the lid off like this and you can put in your diamonds like that. Now this would be good as an excess storage, like if you have drill extras and stuff, but the containers are a lot smaller than I think they were advertised. So I'm not 100% sure about this, but I believe that this is going to hold 200 drills and we're going to go ahead and check it out and, and see for ourselves. So let me go grab some drills. This is my order from Smith's Beads over in England. They actually sent me the entire drill pack that I need for my heaven and earth design, which is mini cushion cranberry. These are square drills and I have a video all about that. I'll make sure to put that in the eye as well. But as you can see in here, they have lots of diamonds and you know, there's varying, varying amounts, like look at all that 310, right? Uh, but let's go ahead and choose a color that you can see that has multiple drill packs. And we're going to test it out and see how many we can get. Now, generally, these hold 200 drills. So let's see how many we can get in. All right, you ready? So we got to take off the cap. Not too bad, not too shabby. We've got our funnel. Open it up. Now, I don't know, does it fit? It doesn't fit. Well, it kind of fits. Okay, see? I squished it in there. Let's see what we can do. So, how many drill packs do you think 
things going to fit? Oh, we've got, that's 200 drills. Whoops. Oh my goodness. Wow. That actually holds way more than I thought it would. All right. Maybe diamonds are just, I keep forgetting how small these things are. So this would be 400 roughly. We're about at the halfway point now. going to be 600. We might be able to fit 800 drills. I wonder. Six, oh, oh, of course I did that. The good thing about the funnel <laughs> is that I was able to actually just swipe them off the side of the table into the funnel. Thank goodness I cleaned my desk off before this. Okay, hold. Poor. <laughs> it's not that hard, Rachel. <laughs> okay. So this is 800 diamonds. I'm going to tappy tap on the sides. There we go. And it does. It fits. So oh, there's one over here as well. Now where did where did the, where did the lid go? Ah, okay, I found it. Yes. So comfortably 800 drills will definitely fit into these containers. Uh four packs of diamonds. So I think that this will be good. I mean, if you want to use this as excess drill storage, this was not expensive. This is quite inexpensive. I'll have the details down below or on the screen or something. But you get four of these and it says that there are 140 pieces here. So if you get four sets, then you'll be able to get the entire DMC. Uh, I would, what I would do is maybe put this in your wish list and see if maybe they go on sale, but that's not too bad. That's not too shabby. And I like that there is this drawer system. So if I can, why aren't you focusing? Hello? Hello? <laughs> the drawer system is nice and handy uh, to have all of your colors at hand. You could even, oh, let me get rid of that. You could even label them, you know, like, 100 to 399 or what you know however you want to do it oh now I know what that plastic thing's for it actually covers if I can find it there it is it covers this so it has something in Chinese I don't know what that means but it could be the brand uh, but you could replace that with a little slip of paper and then you just put that plastic over top of the paper so that it doesn't get dirty. Very cool. I like it. I think that it's nice. It's very sturdy. This this box right here, it looks like they might even slot into each other. Can you see the top here? I could probably open it the other way, but I'm going to show you. So right here, there are grooves and they should just slide right on top of each other and right next to each other. It's on the sides as well. See that? And it looks like you could even want, mall, mall, mall want this. <laughs> mall, mall, oh my gosh, I can't even get the word out. Wall mount it. That's what I'm trying to say. If you have a craft room where you want to mount these on the wall, that would be kind of cool. They are very heavy though. So you would need to make sure that you have your studs up properly and everything like that. But in general, like, I think, I think that that's actually not a bad, not a bad deal. I'm probably going to use this for the heaven and earth design so that I can easily get to my colors and these stickers, it looks like they fit perfectly on the top. Check that out. Let's see. Yeah. If I can place them right, I think if you use tweezers, maybe would be a good option. There you go. So you could actually get the sticker on the tippy top there. And then open up your drawer, slide it in. Where did it go? Which one did it go in? Did I? I swear I opened this one, didn't I? <laughs> I don't know where this came from. I don't think that they sit equally, or do they? Maybe they do. Maybe there's an extra one in there. I'm not sure. But either way, that's how I think this is going to work. That's pretty cool. Now, over time, 
On my old set, I found that this little lever uh, wore down quite a bit. So I'd be interested to see the long-term effects of this, but this plastic here feels a lot sturdier than the one that I had before. So high hopes for this. I will let you know in a pinned comment later on once I've had a chance to get used to this and use the system, my thoughts and feelings on it. But so far, it, ha oh, it has everything that I want from a storage system. It's tidy. It's stackable. It came with a little free accessory. It's not too expensive for what it is. And I think that it looks really good too. So with all that in mind, if you're interested, I have the Amazon link down below. Keep in mind that it is an Amazon Associates link. So if you do make a, a you know, a purchase with this in your cart, then I will get a small teeny tiny commission from it. But um, anyway, I'll have the non-affiliate link down below too, if, in case you're feeling some kind of way about it. It's all good. Um, Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that it helps you. Again, if you're looking for how to kit up a heaven and earth design, diamond painting, or any of the other storage accessories for diamond painting that I've covered in the past, please go ahead and check those links out. I hope that you have a wonderful day, a wonderful week ahead, and I will see you all soon in my next video. Take care, everyone. Bye!